But then we went to Nevada. All right, we're continuing monitoring of the president's remarks, and I mean no offense to him, or some of you might want to continue hearing, but I did have to say that even though the former president is entitled to his opinion, is, he's not entitled to his own set of facts. The market has indeed been going up, but having nothing to do with him and everything to do with this aggressive cut in interest rates uh, or does a hiking in interest rates and stabilized inflation and, of course, the whole uh, artificial intelligence phenomenon that has benefited NVIDIA and a host of companies that are making money hand over fist. So that, uh, whether you want to give Biden credit for that, has nothing to do with Donald Trump. Furthermore, he mentioned about gas prices out of whack, $6 a gallon. The national average right now is $3.26. Uh, a cents a gallon. He went on to talk about the uh, 2020 election and how that was rigged. Uh, this has been adjudicated many, many times, dozens of times. It's been investigated uh, by everyone and his uncle, no fewer than 44 investigations launched, some of them by judges that were uh, picked by Donald Trump himself that found no evidence of that in the seven battleground states where most of them were focused. Donald Trump lost each and every one of those states and no facts or no history that he mentions on the stump right now will change that. He lost. He is trying to win back that office. And we'll continue monitoring this. But for now, here comes the five.